It's Gunnison here. Another upload for you guys today. Gonna do a live com on three games. Everton, Sporting Lisbon and Fulham. Yeah, I thought, you know what, fuck it. Um, it's just more fresh, you know? But we've been struggling. We've been struggling. Our only one win in the last episode. We're sixth in the league. I don't know how Palace are top or Leicester. But it is what it is. Uh, made quite a few changes going into this tie. But we got Lisbon in two, two game days. Which makes no sense. You know, EA needs to sort this out. And they had the biggest chance to do that. And they failed to do so. But... Man, um, we've got to get redemption over Everton. We failed against them in the Carabao Cup. As you saw in the last episode, I was fuming with rage when uh, Lich Island bottled that penalty. But as you can see there, I have gone with a similar team. But I've recruited some of the young young lads as well. It won't be, as you can see, in Rutez's place. But as you can see here, the starting level for me, Leno's in goal. I prefer him over in uh, them check. I uh, brought back Koscielny ahead of a uh, holding for this game. Laura, uh, Karasinac ahead of Monreal. Torreira, Erzo and Guendouzi in the game for his first Premier League start. Mkhitaryan, it won't be in Lacazette. Six games without a goal. If you know from Aubameyang in career mode, it's not good enough. But I will play it against the uh, sport in Lisbon. I think he will attack the line. But this is Everton starting the line up. Pickford, Coleman, Keane, Zuma and Dini in the back five. Stranin and Anguera, two CDMs. Walcott right wing, Gomez left wing to go to that camp and Tosun soon up front. Walcott back at Arsenal. Oh my days. Okay, let's go. Bellerin. Ozil. To Wenduzi. Arsenal looking to start strong. Oh, it's a brilliant chance. Ozil does well, shoots, is a good save, back in the box, and puts out for a corner, corner kick. Koscielny finds Mkhitaryan, shuffles well past Michael Key, gets a shot of goal, it's another good save. Arsenal with a lot of pressure going into this game, in the 10 minutes. <clears throat> Gerton, on the ball, finds Andre Gomez, Walcott, back at his former club for the first time in ages. It's a good throw, offside. Head to their own. Mesut Ozil. Lacazette. Mkhitaryan. Bellerin now. Looking for Ozil. Takes a deflection but goes in. Ozil gives Arsenal the lead. And they've been dominating for the first 20 minutes or so. There he is. 15 minutes on the clock. And the German. Former put door. Yeah, scores. Yeah, I'm just happy. Oh, that's a dirty deflection of Coleman. But regardless, it's in. Arsenal take the lead and everything is starting strong. There's half time. Our dominant Arsenal in response over a poor form. They've come and scored already. Mesut Ozil with a goal inside 15 minutes. It was found well by Berrien, and Ozil scored via a, def a Michael Keane deflection. Arsenal dominated their first half. It is Arsenal 1, Everton 0. Schneiderlin, Theo Walcott, Idris Sagana Gray, finds Theo Walcott well. He's crossed it in, and it's headed on the post by Gomez. And Arsenal scramble clear. Here comes Matteo Guendouzi. It will be now. Mc does well here. Pass the defender. Here comes it will be. Özil, Mkhitaryan shoots a goal and it's over the bar. But that was brilliant counter-attacking play. But Mkhitaryan's got to take these opportunities, man. He's got to score those. For Arsenal. Sporting Lisbon in mind as Matteo Guendouzi is replaced by Ainsley Maitland Niles. While Everton are making their change with Theo Walcott, former Arsenal man, being replaced by Bernard. 
Not much cheers on his path as he's retired to Arsenal Tower. Michael Keane just passed. He's intercepted by Maitland Niles. Finds Iwobi. Fred's into Lacazette, who's hit the post. Oh, what a chance. Just for Arsenal, Noah Bamiang. Ozil and Lacazette being replaced by Ramsey and Danny Welbeck. I think that uh, means that Aubameyang is going to start against Sporting Lisbon. Free kick taken, and it's another poor free kick as Maitland Niles heads on to Wobi. Back into Maitland Niles, has made a positive impact. Nice football here. Welbeck. Torreira. Nice football. Ramsey the shot. It's blocked. And pushed away by Pickford. Bernard on the ball. McCarthy. That's full time. Arsenal who returned to winning ways. With an, a 1 0 win over Everton. Meza Ozil with the only goal in the game. But there was barely any pressure from the away side. The game finishes. Arsenal 1, Everton 0. We are going to be playing against Sport in Lisbon just after our 1-0 victory over Everton. It was a tight game, it was a tough game. Not many chances created, but we created an important one which led to a goal. Um, yeah, as you can see, we've rechanged the whole back five as well. As you can see, they're holding the Mustafi together. Lichter at right, making Murray as the left back. You know, I put Koscielny on the bench as he reserves, but as you can see, there's Sporting 11's uh, starting 11. Who remembers Viviano? He was a former Arsenal player. He joined off the loan for like 800k. Didn't even make a single Premier League game. It's pretty, pretty incredible. But as you can see, he's 83 rated in FIFA. Bonkers, but. That's their starting 11 as you can see there, but then as you can see, I did put on Emmerich Aubameyang and Smith Rowe for the starting 11 and Williams who's been on form and it's the same formation, Ramsey's the cam, only in Xhaka sitting deep, but I'm looking forward to see how Smith Rowe does, let's get into it. Intercepted by Holden and he finds fellow Englishman Smith Rowe, Emil Smith Rowe! Just have a chance for Bobby Oog and finally gets his first goal of the season. Pierre Michael Bobby Oog gives Arsenal the lead and does that count as a Smith for assist? I certainly think so. He does really well. Slide tackles the guy off the ball. The ball just fa finds its way into a Bobby Oog who hits it onto the top corner outside of the boot. He finally gets his goal and the managers. Gamble with him playing in this game pays off. Arsenal won. Sporting has been nil. Viviano's kick is poor. Here's Obamaye. Monreal. El Nene. That's well here. Lovely play to Ramsey. Smith Rowe. Oh wow. Oh. Rostovsky by Rafinha Will Sporting Lisbon trying to attack but the door still he scores it's frustrating on Arsenal's ball they've been dominating the first half but the guy with a poor receding hairline scores let's not lie he just looks very butters this FIFA they need to sort out his game face it's a very good error from the bad hairline of his. A pair check in no man's land, as always. As always. What is he doing there? <sighs> Williams. Granite Jacko. Pierre Cobbamio. Fires Danny Williams and takes a shot first time and it goes wide. Just wide. Just, just, just wide. It's a good shot. But it goes just wide of the target. Petrovic. 
Monreal does well. Good as deception. Ramsey finds Daddy Williams well. Takes a shot at goal and it's another poor shot and it goes wide. Daddy Williams needs to start scoring more goals if he's going to be selected regularly for Una Emery and Ersin's team. Loses the battle. Now here's Smith Rowe. Shaka. Monreal. Shoot! So this over the bar and that's half time and uh, Arsenal have dominated the first half but we've got from Aubameyang in the early stages after good work from Smith Rowe but that man Bastos with a receding hairline responded well after being fouled by a good cross from Rafinha it is half time and as it stands it's 14 CP1 Arsenal 1 Arsenal second half begins. The look of Smith Rowe does well. It's a free kick as well. Here comes Danny with um, foul on Danny Williams. It is that bad. Pierre Aubameyang to take. Not kind of the gavel easy to actually come up with here. Oh, he's hit the ball. It was a brilliant free kick, and he's very unlucky not to score. Matteo Guendouzi replaces NL Smith Rowe. He's got the assist, first assist of his career, but he's been replaced by the failure looking Kevin Luiz. Cuartes, Fernandez. Up to Quarto, Gisdelli, Jefferson, Bruno Fernando, Jefferson, Marcos Acuna. So good football from the home side here. Here comes Fernandez. Trust in. Sending in, but not away. Acuna with a shot. And it's away by Guendouzi. So good clearance. Now Aubameyang, got a lot of pace, and he takes all back to you, and he does well here Aubameyang, Pierrick Aubameyang, options in the box, it's been fouled, there it is too, goals for Arsenal right now, Danny Williams finally scores, but it was brilliant play from the first goal scorer, Pierrick Aubameyang, well what a run that was, Skipping past two, skipping past three, with a delightful cross. And all he had to do, the English striker, was just to tap it home. And he does. Arsenal's take the lead again in the second half. Master stroke of a clearance from Matteo Guendouzi that set up a Bobby Young on his way. He had a lot to do, the Gabonese international, but he skipped past two players there before crossing it in for Williams to score. It was a brilliant, brilliant solo assist. With a throw in. Into Monreal. Finds El Nenny. Looking for Lichtenstein. That's a brilliant pass. And it's a good cross. It's just headed away. Mustafi. It's a brilliant pass into Lichtsteiner, it's a good cross, and his save, oh my god, what a save from Viviano, quite easily almost grabs his second goal of the season, poof, and Ali in the meantime, poor pass from Acuna to Acuna, last minute on the, here comes Ramsey, well back, finds Eddie Aketia, does well, Finds Danny Williams, Ramsey, could be a goal here, it is, and it's Guendouzi! Matteo Guendouzi continues his fine, impressive goal form with a brilliant goal, but it was a brilliant team move. Start off by Ketia, Far Williams, into the starter, and there it is, Matteo Guendouzi, France's best player since Thierry Henry, with a goal. <coughs> oh my god, I'm just chatting there. <laughs> Guendouzi, who needs a sort out of game face for him? 
EA, sort out his game face for fuck's sake. And there it could be full time imminent, 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 imminent. There it is, and Arsenal go two wins from two in the Europa League game. The manager took the risk by resting a bomb in a game against Everton. They won their game against Everton. So he started against Sporting Lisbon. And what does he do? He gets a goal and an assist. He then goes off. Guendouzi, who came on as a sub, gets a goal. And this guy is loving life at the Emirates right now. Arsenal win 3 1. Dos scored before Sporting Lisbon. It was enough at half time, but it wasn't enough at full time. Sport and CP1, Arsenal 3, full time result. Kaboosh! <laughs> Fulham the Arsenal. I, I was impressed. Impressed by the substitution of Renduzzi. He scored. Provided a good attack as well. You know. But, as you can see here, Fulham start with a good team. Chambers, although from us, started. Mostly meant to right back. He's a good quality right back for them. Uh, Seri, the main player, but Sessegnon. That's an exciting left winger player. Shell on the bench. No one, no, no Metrovic in the squad. It's a bit weird. But as you can see here, I've gone back to the usual defence of the Premier League. This seems to be my Premier League defence. Scott is a Kalasic left back. Torreira, Urzo, and Gendouzi. He's been impressed with me, so he's starts a three. But I brought back him above my head for this game. He pressed me against um, Sporting, so I had to start him. Hopefully, he'll get some more goals and add. And just be a fight all player for us. But can we go three wins in a row? Let's just hope so, man. I'm pretty confident, you know, and we've been playing good FIFA today, so hopefully, we can respond well. McDonald loses a tussle against number 31 Kalasinac. Oh, it's a brilliant pass from Granduzzi. Oh, boy. Can he get there? He can, McTyre. Uh, it's away. Vieto. Loses the ball. Number 31 Kalasinac. Torreira. Obama oh, with a shot. Oh, that's a good save. It's a good save. Out of nowhere as well from Obama. Oh, that is it. Finds him again. Takes a shot. It's a corner kick. Taking a deflection. Good start. Pass intercepted well by Arsenal. Here comes Socrates Papastafapoulos. Passes it to Torreira. There's it, Ozil. Obama. Oh, Gwen Doozy. Lovely football. Like Kolasinac. Finds Obama. Oh, Tees it up. But that's a brilliant. I don't know what that was, but full of get it clear. As far as better in. Oh, Torreira lays it off for Ozil's first home finesse. Oh, it's over the ball. He's got to do better than that. He wants to add more goals. But he's been good for Arsenal this season, there's Ozil. He's got to do better than that. Better in. Poor. Now Sessegnon running through the space that Bellerin has created for him. Crosses it in well. Five. Vieto! He's hit the bar! And it's bundled in! By Ayite of Fulham. Fulham taking the lead. Well, the keeper was left in no man's land. And it's poor goalkeeping. It's a massive error. Out of the out of nothing, Fulham have actually scored. Henry hits the bar, but no communication whatsoever. And Aguita just heads it home. Credit McCoy has gone wild. Poor from Arsenal perspective. Fulham take the lead. 1-0. Arsenal looking to start from square one again. Going to lose the black is it. Victoria, Bobby A. Does well, keeps the ball, finds Ozil. I'll still look at to immediately respond with Torreira! They respond with Torreira! Arsenal 1, 
Fulham won. It's a brilliant goal. It's a brilliant way to respond. Without a touch, Fulham have conceded. Brilliant skill by Ozil. Lays it off into Torreira, who just thunderbolts home into the top corner of the Fulham net. Callum Chambers cannot do anything about that to stop his parent club scoring. It's a brilliant goal. McDonald, Seri, Vieto. Here comes Philly looking for their own kickoff goal here. Here's Kolasinac. Brilliant pass into a Pierre Cabaria who might just be through a goal. It's a Bobbyan! And Arsenal have got the lead! And a Bobbyan, first from, from a man of the match performance against Lisbon, scores. He gets his first Premier League goal this season and the game's been tipped on its head and as the was four minutes. Brilliant passing to Kolasinac. He finds a Bobby out, escaping through, from goal and he bends that one into the top corner. Fulham one, Arsenal two. I am over-exaggerating about that shot but it is what it is. Come on! Sorry. Kishoni, it's a lovely pass into Kolasinac. Could get two. Oh, it's a brilliant pass into Mkhitaryan here. Here comes Mkhitaryan. Fake shots one. Finds Torreira. Makes it three. Wow. Wow. What a game this has been. And what one-sided football this has been from Arsenal since they conceded. And it's the Uruguayan tank that is Torreira who gets his second goal of the game. And Arsenal have taken a two-goal lead inside Craven Cottage. It's turned silent. But the Arsenal fans have gone wild. They have gone from 1-0 down to 3-1 up in the space of just, what, 10 minutes? What football this has been. And there's another through ball from Kalasinac that just starts it off. Into a Mkhitaryan. Cuts it well. Tees up the Uruguayan player. And he just hits it into the goal. Two from him. Fantastic goal from Arsenal. From Arsenal's corner kick. Taken by uh, Mkhitaryan into Ozil. To Torreira actually. Crossed in his block. Punched away and that's a ball. And it's over the ball by Kalatinac. Oh my god, my Luka Lach just headed it over the bar. That is a big opportunity to score. He has been superb with his range of passing. But he's been poor with his range of heading. Wow. To Fulham to be taken by Seri on the eve of half time. It's a poor, poor free kick. And there it is. There's half time. A rampant Arsenal have taken a 3 1 lead going into the break. But Fulham took the lead through Ayite after a poor defending from Arsenal. But then that man there, Torero, managed to scrub two goals inside 10 minutes. But in between the two goals, Obama Yang scored after a brilliant pass from Kalasinac. And as you know, it is full of one. Arsenal three on the break. With that man there, who's just miskicked that shot in full form. I guess. Here goes Callum Chambers. And Sabo Aguisa. McDonald. Back into Aguisa. Vieto. McDonald. Into Ayite. Vieto. Bosu Mensa. Now the goal scorer is on the ball here. It's a good cross. Easily away by Socrates Papastafapalos. Now Aubameyang on the counter attack. Here's Torreira who fires Mercatorian. Mercatorian is through a goal. Aubameyang in assistance. He goes alone. That's a good save from Fabrizio. They've got to score that one. It's got to be 4-1 at this stage. But it's a good save from the uncapped Spain goalkeeper. There's the substitution. Sherlock replaces Aite. Arsenal. And it's punched away. But Koscielny gathers. He finds Torreira. On the verge of a hat trick, potentially. Here's Ozil. Brilliant pass. Into Kalasinac. It's a good save. Substitutions of the game. But Fieto has come off for Camara. There he is, you can see. Meanwhile. Ramsey is replaced with Doozy and Maitland Nars has replaced Ozil. Two brilliant players off the field. 
Here's Torreira. Mkhitaryan. Mkhitaryan, the Armenian Spice. Does well here. On the run still. Like he's running away from the police. He's away. Here's Mkhitaryan. Crossed there to Lacazette. And he scores. It's 4-1 Arsenal. And Lacazette does that lovely celebration of his. As Arsenal make it 4 Brilliant run from Mkhitaryan. Brilliant cross from Mkhitaryan. Brilliant header from Lacazette. Fill him out. Bump, 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 bump. Here comes Koscielny into Socrates, into Torreira, who finds Bayeri, who passes it into Mkhitaryan, and sees the run around Z, and there goes Lacazette on the run, and he's through on goal, he shoots and he scores, it's 5-1 to Arsenal on the 81st minute. Hey, 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 I'm getting carried away. But that was another brilliant goal. And after with full fourth, going full ham against Fulham at Craven Cottage. As the Arsenal fan cools down. He, McDonald's on the ball for Fulham. He ends it down to Kenny, and that's a poor strike. Now can Arsenal counter attack again? Here's Leno. I don't know what the fuck he was thinking. But he makes a good save. It's a corner kick to Fulham. Loses the ball to the Uruguay, and that's the win for Arsenal. Arsenal go full ham against Fulham and they smash the West London side 5-1 they were absolutely brilliant today and just like in that match against Fulham in real life Arsenal in career mode stalled into a 5-1 win Lacazette with two goals Aubameyang with one goal I can't remember who got the rest because I'm so happy right now. There we go. Two goals from Torreira. Then the offensive is terrified. Two goals from Torreira. Yeah, the offensive is terrified and I'm, a, I'm, a, and I'm very high for. But it is what it is. 5 1. D. We won our first game 1 0. Poof! We dismantled Lisbon 3 1. And then we smashed this team 5 1. Hey. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh wow there we go that's better in up to 82 rated as well it will be very close to 78 rated <sighs> jesus christ i'm so hyperactive <laughs> uh, but yeah um oh who's injured now oh don't tell me who's it oh don't tell me it's so unimportant fuck's sake oh it's only for nine days but yeah, we're going to the international break. It's been your boy Goodison. Next episode, we'll be playing against Leicester, Lilstrom, and Palace. But yeah, before that important game against Liverpool. It's been your, it's been your boy Goodison. Make sure you like the video. Subscribe. In a bit, people. In a bit.